Jade just told me there's been an outbreak on the 18th floor. I've got to get what little Antis and I have back to the tower pronto. Brecken, this is Crane. Do you copy? Brecken, do you copy? Shit. Jade, this is Crane. Do you copy? Crane, how much after this did you get? Listen, Rice wanted me to use... Look, he screwed us, okay? I only got five vials. What? Jade just told me there's been an outbreak on the 18th floor. I've got to get what little Antis and I have back to the tower pronto. Do you have the Antis in? Give it to me. So what happened? One person turned and had a couple of other people trapped. We could have sealed off that one apartment, but Brecken wanted to save as many lives as possible. It went bad. Somebody had to make the call, and now we've lost the entire floor, including... including a couple of kids. You'd better talk to Brecken. I have to get these meds to Lina. As soon as the crate hits the ground, there's a guy in orbit. Thank <laughs> you. 
It's waiting. This is where we get the announcements about the Antisyntropes. And they've just stopped. They were kids in there! I froze. Lena had to step up. Maybe she should be in charge. What the fuck, Crane? I'm no leader. I'm a goddamn parkour instructor. We saw all the free running. But that was you? Bracken, you showed these people how to survive. Do you know who my pockets were full of when I showed up in Haran? Fucking business cards. I was hoping to drum up some more students. Maybe get enough so I could save up and buy a house. Instead of that poxy little flat I've been renting. Listen. I'm gonna talk to Rice myself. Whoa, whoa, H hang on a minute. Reckon these people still need you. Dude, just, just give me some time, all right? There's, there's gotta be another way. A better way. Fine. I'll wait. But not for long. Finally, I get to do some actual good. Raheem? Raheem, what are you doing up here? Hey, Crane. Can I trust you? <laughs> How much you had to drink, kid? Can I or not? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up? See that skyscraper? Scout from the volatile nest in there. We take that out, and then running missions at night, we could totally do that. So I'm thinking, if we planted some explosives, Oh, Jesus. Raheem, you're not still on that. Crane, we have to do this. As long as that nest is there, we'll never be able to gather up enough antisim. It would work. We make a good team. Ah! Shit, oh my... Ah! Don't drop me! Don't drop me! Oh, fuck. <laughs> See? Told you we make a good team. Look, Raheem, we don't have any explosives. I mean, none. The closest thing to what you're talking about are Spike's firecrackers. It, that, it's impossible. You don't know what it's like. All I can do is watch, sit on my ass, and watch everything happen and do nothing. I don't want to die here, Crane. Not like this, not helpless. If I go out, I'd rather go out doing something. What's this? I was set to fly out on Sunday. They quarantined us on Thursday. I already had my bags packed. I'll... Get, look, I'll keep my eyes open, okay? If there's some way we can make this happen. Whatever. Oh. This is Crane, do you copy? What do you want, Crane? 
want you to start the antizen drops again, at least near the tower. These people need help. We put you in Haran to find our file, not to play Mother Teresa. Or does this mean you've reconsidered Ryza's proposal? Perhaps Miss Aldermere would even be willing to cooperate, test her skills in a new environment. You start giving us some antizen and then... Then we'll talk about what Rise wants. Oh, it's us now, is it? Well, I'm afraid your request is out of the question in any case. Things have gotten a bit strained with the Ministry. Resuming the airdrops would not be politically advantageous at the moment. Are you assholes to take the fucking cake, you know that? You and your fucking file. Look, I'll locate the file for you, but I'm gonna take a good long look at it before I decide what to do about it. Loud and clear, what can I do for you? I don't know how much time we have, so the short version. I need your help. Rice has turned an abandoned school into a supply dump. And I think it may be where he's storing his antizen. If you and I sneak in there, we could get all the meds the tower needs. Are you with me? Yeah, I'm with you. Great. Look for me in one of the boxcars on the train trestle near the school. Okay. And listen, Jade. If we don't find and that answers it, I'll need to talk to you about something. About what? Another option, but we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Right now, let's see what we can find in that school. Jade knows where we might be able to get more antis in. I'm supposed to meet her in one of the boxcars near the school.
His men have been hauling boxes out of that place for hours. We need to get a closer look. What's in the boxes? Good question. If it's Antizen, we need it. Bandits are inside. I only saw the ones that went in after Tahir, but I'm sure there's more. We should use different entrances. We'll cover more ground, and we'll make less noise moving separately. They've got this door sealed off from the inside. You got any alternatives? I remember playing here as a kid. There was a basement entrance at the back of the building. No harm in trying.
Sate here at the school. He and his men were hauling all kinds of stuff out of there. What the hell are they up to? Anyway, the fucker executed some survivors right in front of us. Nearly saw us. Time to sneak into that building. I hope there's some antizen in there somewhere. Okay, Jade, I'm inside. Check the classrooms. That's the most likely place for them to store supplies. They should be marked somehow. Military jargon is pretty straightforward, so it shouldn't be hard to notice. Get through that way.
check the basement? Of course not, because the key is still up here. Get your shit together!
Shit, no luck with any antizen. Looks like we'll have to talk about that other option. I still have classroom C to search, though. The basement's pretty big. Find the key. I'll meet you down there. Here, would you? Yeah, sure. God, Crane, you're such an old. Why don't you just stick your head out the door and shout, Here we are, come get us! Hey, sometimes there's nothing wrong with the direct approach. Holy shit. That's plastic explosives, right? Listen, you take this stuff and get back to the tower. I'll deal with these assholes. Don't be ridiculous. We'll fight them together. And risk letting them keep this much ordinance? No, just go. I got this. Meet me back at the tower. Promise me you won't let Rahim near that height. What? Yeah, of course. I promise. I promise. Just go.
shit. Jade and I went looking for Antizen and found explosives instead. Now we need to get the hell out of here before Tahir comes back. if we didn't find any antizen. And we will, but right now let's deal with these explosives, okay? Okay, listen. I'll give the explosives to Saeed and you talk to Rahim. Make sure he stays away from that hive. Will do. Don't worry. Don't worry? Right. There's a lot to be done around the tower. I hope you find... Jade called me. She's taking the explosives to Saeed. She wanted me to talk to Rahim about the volatile hive and how she wants him to stay the hell away from it.
Crane, Saeed told me about the explosives you guys found. How perfect is that? Jade gave them to him. Saeed used to be on a bomb squad, so he knows about that stuff. Yeah, kid. That was a lucky find. Would have been better to turn up some antis in, though. My buddy Omar is making sure Saeed put the good timers on those things. We have to be able to get our asses out of there before they blow. Whoa, we? There, there's no we in this. I, I mean, yeah, that nest needs to go, and now it's possible, but... But if it gets done, I'm doing it on my own. But... It's my plan. And I will execute it perfectly, I promise. But... Ah, oh, shit. There's no use arguing with you, is there? Fine. I'll contact you as soon as Saeed's finished with the charges. Raheem, do we have a deal? I guess. Do we have a deal? Yes. We have a deal. Okay, one more thing. I keep seeing this bizarre kind of infected. Is Dr. Zera out at his trailer? I'd like to talk to him about it. Nah, he's down in sick maybe visiting Dr. Lena. Thanks, kid. I'll see you soon. Doc, you got a minute? Oh, it's, uh, Kane. Yes. Uh, how can I help you? Uh, Crane, remember when I told you about that weird infected I saw? You know, the one who took one look at me and hauled his ass away? Yeah, well, I just saw another one, and it did the same thing. Hmm. I believe I have heard your colleagues talk about those creatures. Bolters, they call them. Apparently, they favor certain areas of town over others, but only appear at night. I don't suppose you could catch one and bring me a sample of its flesh. You see, a thought occurred to me. A long shot, I realize. But if these creatures favor areas where I left my experimental bait, well, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Please do obtain a sample, but it has to be fresh. So you have to get it back to me quickly. Okay, and where exactly do I find these things? I'm told that Quartermaster chap has been keeping track of them. Zara asked me to bring him a sample from that bolter I saw in front of the school. He said they'd been spotted in specific areas of the city, so I should focus my search in those places. He also said I needed to get that sample back to him while it was still fresh. So I gotta move. There's a lot to be done around the tower. What can I do for you? Doc Zera says you know where I should look for these, uh, bolters. Super fast infected, covered in big green blisters. Oh yeah, yeah. I can point you in the right direction. Here, here, and here. Though you ask me, if trouble don't come looking for you, no reason to go looking for trouble. <laughs> Words to live by, thanks. Come here, I've got a special deal for you. 